How's it going, everybody? Steve here from Pursuit for Better with a incredible guest uh, with me that I just wanted to take a second to introduce you to um, because uh, there's going to be some really awesome content coming up here in the next, um, well, just actually for the foreseeable future. So um, first off, I'm really excited uh, to finally be able to introduce my wife, Anna. Hello. Uh, and uh, she's going to be joining us in a really cool capacity uh, on our channel. Um, for me, like I was on keto, I think, for probably close to 10 months um, before any of my family uh, decided to kind of, well, any of my family, my girls have still yet to really <laughs> embrace it, um, but before you really kind of started. And uh, so for all of you out there that have family members that are not on board, I, I feel I feel you, I relate to you. Um, but just stick with it, stay on it, because you never know when a spouse or family member or someone that's going to be there might jump on. And so um, what was, because I know obviously you can see she didn't really need to do anything for weight <laughs> loss. Um, but I know that she wanted to do it for other reasons. So what would you say was your main reason for wanting to do keto? Mine was mainly because... I was feeling tired all the time. I had no energy. Um, my blood pressure was really high. There was a lot of stress. Um, so a lot of that was just to uh, be healthy and feel good and feel like I was 20 again. And I think that doing keto has definitely helped me have more energy, be able to do more things, to work out more. Um, and I'm actually excited about uh, sharing some keto recipes that I've learned to make because I love to cook. So um, I'm really enjoying learning how to make different keto um, type foods. So um, super exciting and I, I feel so much better. I feel like I don't have as much inflammation and um, my skin feels nicer and just there's just so many positives I can go on and on but definitely feel like I have more energy and I just feel overall a whole lot better than I used to. Well, the great cook aspect of it is why I needed to get on to the keto diet to begin with because she's a phenomenal cook and I think, uh, of course, she didn't control how much I ate, but it was so good I just biased, usually, <laughs> I'm just saying, you know, when I was up to 350 pounds, you know, the, uh, the good cook aspect of it was really a, a big part of that. Uh, but I'm super excited about what she's going to be doing um, because over the last, uh, I guess, year or so um, mm -hmm. since she's been on uh, keto, and again, um, if you just watched the last update video, video, you know that for the last eight months or so, we have not been gung-ho keto. Mm -hmm. um, we've been kind of struggling. Uh, our family just did a cross-country move, just all sorts of stuff that, that caused a lot of extra stress and strain. Um, but now that we're getting into this, um, you know, I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm just super excited to see her be able to bring some of the things that she's been making for all of us as a family that even our non-keto people really, really seem, uh, seem to enjoy. Um, I just think she's going to help really bring another aspect to our channel, and I think it's going to be awesome. I think you guys are going to really, really enjoy it. So um, I know that you have a couple of things planned over the next week or so. What are what are a couple of the recipes that you're thinking about kind of starting off with for the channel? So I am going to make a um, keto egg roll in a bowl recipe and also a loaded chicken and broccoli recipe that our kids really, really love. Um, so these are recipes that are uh, not only we enjoy but our kids enjoy as well So I'm really excited about cooking that in front of the camera So you guys can all see how I prepare it and these are two recipes that I've made actually several times So I've tweaked them to make them my own So I'm really excited about sharing these recipes that my kids love as well um, and I have tweaked them to be just exactly like how we like them so you don't have to make them exactly how I make them, but um, you could just tweak them to make them your own. And that's what's fun about making these keto recipes. No, I think that's a really important point because I know a lot of people, you know, sometimes they'll see something and they're like, oh, but I can't have that or I don't really like that. Or, that's okay. I mean, the great thing about a lot of these recipes are make them your own. Um, use them as a jumping off point. I know that a lot of people like recipe videos because... You know, a lot of us are visual learners. We, we like to see how something's going to turn out. And sometimes just seeing a picture of something with some text mm -hmm. makes it kind of difficult to kind of just dive in and do it. Um, and when you see somebody that knows what they're doing, kind of getting in there, it makes it a lot easier to do. So the keto uh, uh, egg roll in a bowl, I know we all really, really like. Um, the, uh, the loaded broccoli, chicken and broccoli that we all really like a lot. Um, those are some really good dinner recipes. What are some things that you might be planning on for, like, let's say, a, a breakfast or lunch or dessert or anything else that you can just think of off the top well, of your head? Well, we have a breakfast um, sandwich that I can try to make as well um, with keto chaffles. And also I have made a blueberry mug cake that's really, really good as well. Um, our daughter makes some really good keto chocolate chip cookies, and those are really good 
Um, so we'll try to bring that um, into the videos in the next couple weeks. Yeah, and, and the great thing is, is that you know we really have stuff for all um, you know all meals, breakfast, lunch, dinner, uh, you know desserts. Um, and like I said before, I think we're just there's there's tons of them out there. And in more than anything, we want you guys to be comfortable just kind of diving in and starting to make stuff. Some of these things that we've made, you know, all of us have kind of been like, you know, two thumbs up. Other ones have been like, eh, that one, you know, either some of them we haven't necessarily liked a lot as it was. But all of a sudden, you know, she saw some possibility there and went in and tweaked it and made it to something we, we really like. And so, uh, you know, don't be afraid to kind of just dive in and start making some of these your own. Mm -hmm. um, and don't be afraid to just experiment. One of the, the things that I think get a lot of people off of keto or any real healthy eating lifestyle is they get bored. They get kind of stuck in a rut with the food that they eat. It's like the same thing for breakfast, the same thing for lunch, the same thing for dinner. Um, and we don't want you to do that. We want you to feel you know, comfortable getting in and trying a bunch of new stuff and, and seeing that there's a huge variety of foods that you can eat uh, on the keto lifestyle. So um, having said that, I think we're just both really excited. I'm stoked to be able to see what they're going to be adding to the channel as well, uh, as well as what I get to sit down and eat every night, which is going to be awesome. Uh, and so we're excited for you to come along with us as well. And so um, thank you for tuning in. Um, if you're new to our channel, we'd love for you uh, to, first off, please give this, uh, uh, this video a, a thumbs up. Give us some encouragement to kind of dive in and keep doing the videos. Uh, you know, just absolutely smash that like button. Um, please uh, hop over to our channel, subscribe, click on that uh, bell uh, notification to get uh, notified anytime we do put out new content. Uh, and please give us a comment below. One of the things that we would love is for you to comment some things that you would like to see us make. That gives us ideas, things that we maybe not even were thinking about before. Um, and so just, you know, doing all those things, liking the video, subscribing, commenting, it really does help the YouTube algorithm. It helps to really give us, uh, as a small channel, it, it's just a huge thing that you can do for us. It doesn't cost you a dime and it helps us immensely. So thank you for tuning in and we will see you next time.